Hi everybody, I'm Damian Andrew. Welcome to this DAF Media Special Prelude to a Championship. Darien and Greenwich have high school football programs with storied traditions. Each school has made 14 trips to the state finals. Darien has won six state titles, Greenwich has won seven. But they've never played each other in the biggest game of the season. Well, that'll change on Saturday when the two schools meet up for the Class Double L State Championship. Kickoff is set for 11 o'clock in the morning at Stamford's historic Boyle Stadium. Thousands of fans are expected to attend. Darien is the two-time defending Class Double L State champs. Greenwich last won it all back in 2007. Here's a look at how the Blue Wave and the Cardinals got to this point in the state playoffs. Darien beat East Hartford 30-10 in the quarterfinals. Then they beat a very gritty West Haven team 27-13 in the state semifinals. Greenwich, meanwhile, knocked off Fairfield Prep in the state quarterfinals and then routed South Windsor to punch its ticket to the state championship game. Now the last time Darianne played Greenwich was in last year's Class Double L state playoffs on a cold rainy night in Stanford. The Wave beat the Cardinals 29 to three in the quarterfinals. It was an impressive effort by Darianne on both sides of the ball. Joining me now is the head coach of the Darianne High School football team, Rob Trafone. And coach, we just saw a video of last year's state playoff game between you and Greenwich. This is a much different Cardinals team. What concerns you about Greenwich? How about everything? I mean, a uh, much different team than last year. You know, everyone knew that it would take Johnny Marinelli a couple of years to, to put it all together and he's put it all together. We don't, we don't see a weakness. Their offense is, you know, you know fabulous. Their defense very underrated. Uh, you know, they're very good on defense and their specials are as good as anyone we played. You've had to deal with adversity down the stretch in this season, key players being unable to play. How have you overcome that to get back to the state finals? Well, I think a lot of people counted us out, you know, uh, when adversity hit. And uh, we talked about that as a team, you know. What are you going to do as a man when adversity strikes your life? You know, you're going to lay down or you're going to bounce up and, and come back a little harder. And uh, obviously the, the men chose the latter of the two, and I'm, I'm very proud of them. What has been the mindset of this team throughout these state playoffs? Well, the fact that, um, look, all we have to work with are the guys that are currently on the field, you know, and, and as much as we love, you know, all, our fallen brothers, so to speak, um, you know, we're just going to go forward with what we've got. And, uh, you know, they're, they're not uh, taking, you know, second place. Coach, best of luck on Saturday. Should be a good game. Greenwich comes into Saturday's state championship game undefeated, the number one ranked team in the state. I recently had the opportunity to talk with Hart Cardinals head coach John Marinelli about why this Greenwich team is back in the state finals for the first time in a decade. It's, it's a special group of kids that really have just worked their way so hard to the top. They've tried uh, to really do everything that the coaching staff has put in front of them from off-season lifting to yoga, seven-on-sevens, uh, leadership council for, for a big portion of our football team. Um, you know, they get trained as you know, leaders and our coaching staff runs the training. And it, there's just so much that goes into being a football player um, and it's, it's selfless effort. Darianne has the chance to do something historic Saturday and that is three-peat, win three straight state championships. So the importance of this game is not lost on the Blue Wave players. We're more fired up than anyone could possibly be. I've never seen a team practice as hard, a team have this much of a chip on their shoulder, be this just angry about everyone we face. I mean, the, the practices have been ramped up to a level I've never even seen before. I think we couldn't be more ready for this game. Well, we all know what happened on Turkey Bowl, and then we came back and beat some two good teams, and you know, right now we're just focusing on how we're going to be remembered from this season and not what we were remembered for for Turkey Bowl, and so we're just trying to come out with a bang. Very hungry. Um, we're very close as a team, and that loss really hurt. So we're very hungry as a unit, I'd say. Everyone's very excited. Um, mood definitely is uh, good. I mean, two really good wins. Um, 
it was definitely we were hurting after that loss because I mean we're not used to it. Um, so, but we've been able to bounce back and really uh, everyone's playing their best football right now. So it's Darianne versus Greenwich Saturday for the Class Double L State Championship. It's the second straight season the two FCAC teams will square off in this game. Just shows you the strength of the conference. Well, that'll do it for this DAF Media Special Prelude to a Championship. For our entire production crew, I am Damian Andrew. Thanks for watching, and this has been a production of the Darianne Athletic Foundation.